Good work is something that brings about good health. And this is where we're into job design more than anything else. Yeah. These are the sort of things people, people need to be built into their job. They need to feel that their employment in some way is secure. As secure it can be in the, the modern world. That's how you explain the context of what you work in. Yeah. They like and need, we all like to have some sense of control of what we do. Yeah. That's not over every single thing, but in terms of how you manage your tasks, some, some sense of, I've got five things to do, it's for me to decide how it, the, the order I do them, as long as by Tuesday or whatever day it is, all five are done. It's that bit of freedom. They used to have, they used to have this kind of balance between the work that they're given to do and the rewards they receive. And those, those can be hard rewards and soft rewards. Yeah. And even some sense of fairness in the workplace and how you, how you treat people, procedural justice. And so, it's, so it's, you know, you treat people in a fair way, not necessarily the same way. And you need to have high, high trust relationships. They need to trust you, you need to show trust in them, and they need to trust each other and their colleagues. And that's the way, how you listen, how they express their opinions, how you listen, how you respond. And if health goes down, these things go down. And again, all of those translate into poor performance. Or they translate into a cost for the organisation. Healthy employees perform well, make you money. Simple as that. And you don't have to invest a lot in terms of hard cash. A lot of this is about how you treat people. Treat people well, they will, you will help keep them well. Well people will perform. So a lot of what I'm saying isn't about finding lots of money. It's just about putting some thought into our actions. <laughs>